Grand Rising loved ones, welcome back to another episode of Healing Wisdom with me, your favorite spiritual advisor, Empress Oracle. Today, I would like to talk to you guys about paying it forward because, you know, I'm pretty sure we've all heard about paying it forward. I think there was a movie titled As Such or something like that back in the day or something, but everybody has heard of paying it forward. And paying it forward basically is when someone does a kind act for you, you doing another kind act for a person who you don't know, you don't expect something back from. Basically like you're just randomly blessing somebody. That's paying it forward, okay? However, what I wanna say about paying it forward is a lot of, a lot of paying it forward has to do with your intentions, okay? Now, I see and I have seen, especially before this pandemic and all these crises started to rise in, there was a lot of people advertising their good deeds and stuff. However, the intent behind it was, was not pure. And so, you know, people was getting called out on it and stuff. And I mean, to each his own, personally, I feel as though a good deed is a good deed. However, a good deed with the wrong intention is almost as bad as not doing anything or no deed at all. You know what I mean? Because there's a lot of times, there's a lot of people who do things under the guise of paying it forward just to make themselves look good. You know, they're, they're trying to get praise. They're trying to get attention and stuff. But what they don't even realize is if you're doing something out of your heart or from a place of benevolence, of love and stuff, it's not it's not for the attention. It's not for the praise. You're genuinely doing it just because spirit guided you to do it. And that's how you honestly get your blessings. When you sit in there and you're doing a good deed and you want the world to see this stuff, you're not taking into consideration the person who you're helping. They're down on their luck. They, they might have been on their last. Everybody has their pride. You know, you know how it is when you feel rock bottom. A lot of us, we don't even like to go to people for help because of our pride, because we don't want to be put on blast. We don't want to be looked at differently and stuff. But yet we go ahead and we do these deeds and say we're paying it forward. And we do those same things that we don't want done to us, to these other people. So then that makes you wonder, like, what is your intent behind doing this, this kind deed? What is your intent? Because at the same time, what we have to realize when we're paying it forward, at that time, pride should go out the window. Accolades should go out the window. Attention should go out the window. It should go down. Race, color, all that shit should go out the window. What you can get from it should go out the window. The fact that you're paying it forward in hopes that God or spirit or anybody is gonna bless you in return, all of that should go out the window. It should be out of the kindness of your heart because you genuinely want to. And when you are helping somebody, you should take into consideration. What if it was you? How would you want to be treated? Would you want somebody to showcase their kind act of helping you when you're, you're at your lowest? Would you want them to broadcast that shit on national TV? on all social media for likes, not taking in consideration your hard time? Is that what you're doing it for? Is That's not really paying it forward, guys. It's a good deed, yes. But the intention behind it is not pure. You don't get your blessings like that. Paying it forward involves integrity because when you're paying it forward, you're doing what's right when nobody's watching, when it's just you it's for somebody else out of the kindness of your heart. Because, because, just fucking because. Alrighty? That's how you get your blessings. That's how you guys get your blessings, all right? Paying it forward with the intentions to receive blessings back or to receive something back that's not the real pain it forward. You may not get blessed because it's not a pure intention. It's not genuinely 
out the kindness of your heart, your free will. You're doing it with ulterior motives, guys. All right? You got to learn. Paying it forward is doing things just because. Just because. That's what paying it forward is. Not expecting anything in return from it. Not, not expecting acknowledgement, accolades, pats on the back. Paying it forward is when you see somebody who is in need and you have it, you give it without a second thought, without thought of the, the loss that is going to affect you giving to that person. You just do it, okay? Because you know you'll get it back because you know the universe will bless you again, and they will. That is the true paying it forward, and that's how you receive your blessing, okay? I was always taught from when I was a young girl, you have to give with a pure heart. You have to give without expecting back in return. So when you guys are giving grudgingly, only because it looks good or because it sounds good or because people are watching or because you're expecting something back, you may not get back all that you think you deserve because your heart and your intentions were not pure. Alrighty, when you give your blessings out, when you put your blessings out into the universe, you give them out with benevolence, with a pure and loving heart from a place of peace, love and light, expecting nothing in return. And the universe will bless you another way. That is the true act of paying it forward. And that's how you get your blessings back in return. That's something a lot of people need to take into consideration. When somebody is at their lowest, that's not when you put them on blast. When they're down, they have nothing. That's not when you put them on blast. Now, if they say it's fine after the fact or whatever, that's that's one thing. That's one thing. But just to show the world like, hey, look at me doing, I'm doing this good deed. That say you don't do much good fucking deeds. If you feel like you need a fucking gold star for the shit. Excuse my French. I'm sorry. I guess I'm I guess I'm feeling really passionate about this. <laughs> but yes. Okay? Give with a pure heart. Pay it forward with a pure heart. Give without expecting anything in return. Give to those who don't have those who you see that are down and have nothing without expecting anything in return, okay? When nobody's looking, don't just give for Facebook Live or Instagram Live. Don't just help people out for Instagram Live or Facebook Live. Do it because it moves you. Do it because when you look at that person, you it moves your heart and you feel like, damn, if that was me, I would want somebody to help me as well. That's how you pay it forward. And that's how you get your blessings. And the blessings never come from where you expect them to come from. But the universe will bless you way more than what you expect. But you gotta do it right, guys. We gotta do it right. And also too, if your heart tells you to help somebody, do it. It don't matter how small it is, even if it's just opening the door for them, because sometimes you never know. We have earth angels walking around here disguised as homeless people, disguised as disabled people, disguised as our elders, disguised as our essential workers. We have all types of star seeds and earth angels and all types of transplants here. You never know who you're gonna come across always act with integrity always do what's right always pay it forward whenever you can without expecting anything because you never know who you may help and you never know how it might bless you that's just a quick word i wanted to give y'all today enjoy the rest of your evening be blessed and i love you guys okay